Hey guys and girls, this is GamerKiller2347. So it has been, um, welcome to movie review number 12. It has been, okay, the last time I did a movie review was in 2019, almost three years ago. It was when I reviewed Invader Zim, uh, Enter the Forbes. So, I have not made a movie review. My last movie review was last decade. So, my last movie review was before the pandemic. Now, those of you who watch my I believe it was my San Andreas stream where I said this, but it was one of the GTA streams, so now I, I talked about how uh, that was after, um, you know, Mr. Enter had made, um, had made his turning red review, and um, it got a lot of, um, and is Probably the the worst review Mr. Incher has ever done, honestly. Um, so so that that was really the main reason why I wanted to make this uh, this review, but. Uh, no, there will be some movie reviews. I, I will likely do some movie reviews soon. Uh, possibly, like, like, newer movies that come out, and maybe I'll, I might review some, like, old, some older movies, because I've, I've done that before, but, um, so yeah, let's talk about Turning Around. Uh, I thought it was a good movie, um, so, really what's happened was that, okay, so, so, of course, before, before Mr. Inter made his review, Turning Red got a lot of attention for, um, you know, this is like a, you know, the director, like, wanted this to, made this a personal story, and like, that's, um, and that's just, that's different for Pixar, um, and, uh, so, th it's definitely different from a lot of Pixar movies, uh, so th that's really what's, what's called, what's, uh, has really got Turning Red to get a lot of attention, um, and in my personal opinion, you know, I mean, there's a debate over, you know, almost pretty much all of the Pixar movies that have been released so far have been... Uh, relatable. Um, now, Turning Red um, is that one Pixar movie that a lot of people are debating over whether or not it relates to everyone. And in my and I think it does because I mean, really, this is about like. Um, you know, di like, disagreements with your, um, you know, with your parents, and I mean, that's something that, um, I think I can, um, at least I can relate to, I'm sure, I'm, I think a lot of people can relate to that, because, I mean, let, let's be honest, I mean, how have you never had any kind of disagreements with, with your parents, so, that, that's what I think, really stands out of why I think Turning Red it is relatable to everyone. 
Bruce Lee. We want you to hurt yourself. Uh, but yeah, I like, um... I mean, I thought this movie was pretty cool. I mean, you know, I mean, um, you know what? Let me, okay, I probably should have said this at the beginning, but, um, like most movie reviews, this, um, there's definitely a, um, I'm, I might give out a few spoilers, so if you've never seen it, um, I would not recommend that you watch the rest of this video. Um, but, but, but yeah, um, I think, you know, so of course I really like where, um, I, I like this whole concept of turning into you know, a red panda, you know, I think it's kind of cool, I think personally, what's really cool, I thought, was the end, where her mom turns into the red panda as well, and is, uh, you know, she, she's like, you know, like, so fucking huge, <laughs> and I thought that was definitely cool, um, And I think personally, um, and I'm not really a fan of boy bands, but, but whatever, you know, you know, that's, you know, I don't really care too much about that, but anyway, now let me talk a bit about Mr. Inter, so, um, Mr. Inter made his review, and he said, he, okay, so, I haven't said this yet, but, okay, so this movie is set in the year 2002, and Mr. Inter tried pointing out why, several reasons why he didn't think that was realistic, but, what he said specifically, the, the one that got the most attention was he said that, um, okay, this is 2002, it's, um, this movie is set a year after 9-11, and he, um, talked about how he, um, basically what he said was that, um, what was it, it altered the cult, you know, in 2002, you know, 9-11 had altered the, the culture so much to the point where, where a lot of this stuff could not even be realistic, such as the scene where, um, where her mom was outside of the school, and, um, And, you know, he thought that there sh it would be realistic if there was, like, more security. And, and there's, um, and then, of course, he also did mention boy bands, uh, as well. And that they were kind of, 2002 would also not be realistic for that. Because, um, you know, that was the year that, um, that Justin Timberlake started his solo career. So, uh, but, but yeah, the 9 11 part was what really got the most attention. And in my opinion, look, I mean, and of course, um, Well, here, here's what I think, you know, I mean, you really need, I mean, it's, 
I mean, you really need to keep a lot of movies, I think, you know, I mean, shouldn't be like, this is one of those movies that like, you know, shouldn't really, Pixar movies in my opinion just really aren't, they, they've never been political, so I mean, politics really does not fit into, um, into this movie, um, you know. And it, it would just be 9-11, I mean, yeah, I get what he's trying to say, but it's just, it would be completely out of place, in, I, despite the fact that it's set in, in 2002. Um, so... So yeah, there's there's that. Um, but yeah, I'm um, I'm happy that I'm getting back into uh, movie reviews. I might do some more. Uh, I'm definitely planning to do some more. I might do some more reviews soon. I've um, of not just movies. I've done like TV shows and episodes, I might do some of those, I've done a lot of episode reviews, but I, um, I don't know how many of them I've done, really, video game reviews, I might do it as well, so just, um, uh, so, I would just definitely keep, um, Uh, just, uh, so yeah, I'll, reviews, I'll definitely get done soon, um, I'm almost done with, um, with college, uh, I've got, I got a test I need to take tomorrow, and I got a test I need to take on Thursday, and, um, and I'm, uh, And I'm going to be out of town for the weekend, but uh, hopefully I can get back to doing some more reviews soon. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, please like, comment, subscribe, and peace out fam.